Missouri Tigers defensive lineman Terry Beckner Jr. talks about being from St. Louis N.D. Linezo while speaking to media at the NFL Scouting Combine on Saturday, March 2, 2019. Indianapolis when he skipped the Senior Bowl in January, Missouri wide receiver Emmanuel Hall promised he would make his mark at the NFL Combine a few weeks later. On Saturday, he came through. Despite being 80 to 90 percent, his words due to a groin injury that lingered during his senior year at MU, Hall set a combine record for his position in the broad jump at 11 feet 9 inches. It's the second highest broad jump in combine history, behind Cowboys cornerback Byron Jones, who jumped 12 feet in 2015. Always known for his speed, Hall's draft stock hinged on his 40-yard dash time, which is around 4.3 seconds when he is healthy. Hall ran a 4.39 on Saturday, which placed him sixth among receivers at the Combine. In the vertical jump, Hall leapt 43.5 inches, which tied him for first place alongside Notre Dame wide receiver Miles Boykin. Hall said on Friday that, because of his groin injury, he only planned on participating in the 40-yard dash and jumping drills. He plans on participating in the rest of the drills at Missouri's Pro Day on March 21. On a conference call with reporters weeks before the Combine, ESPN draft analyst Mel Kuyper Jr. Projected Hall is a 4th to 7th round draft pick, but one who had the chance to help his stock at the Combine. With his size, he's got good length, he'll have some concentration drops at times, but he's got the ability to get down the field, Kuiper said. He's a guy that can beat you deep, and I think he can be a guy that gets into that early day 3, Hall said teams have told him he could move up to day 2, maybe day 3, with a strong performance in Indy. He could move even further up if he shows some ball security on pro day. Hall meets with numerous teams Mizzou linebacker Terrace Hall said he met with too many prospective NFL suitors to count at the Combine, and doesn't want to learn the range he could go in the draft. Hall had 20 reps in the bench press on Saturday and went through field drills on Sunday. Hall roomed with Terrace Howell when they were sophomores and told reporters that the linebacker once went four months of only eating chicken, corn and rice in order to cut body fat. Terrace Hall confirmed the story and said he still occasionally does it and never gets sick of it. You can't get sick of trying to be great, he said. Beckner's weak Tigers defensive tackle Terry Beckner Jr. said he met with a number of teams in Indy, including the Eagles, Giants, Seahawks and Lions informally, along with formal meetings Sunday night with the Dolphins, Vikings and Cowboys. Beckner Jr. had 28 reps on the bench press Saturday after aiming for 30. He ran the 40-yard dash on Sunday hoping to come in under 5 seconds, but clocked a 5.19. Saunders on height Western Illinois defensive lineman Colin Saunders, who had a formal meeting with the Chiefs on Saturday, said he never heard from Missouri, Illinois or any FBS school during his recruitment despite playing at St. Lewis Prep Power Parkway North Saunders measured at 6 feet at the Combine and said his height was a reason a lot of schools passed on him as a college prospect. By Peter Boss special to the star the Missouri Tigers embarked on spring football practices Sunday with unity in the face of NCAA sanctions. March 3, 2019 6.24 p.m. March 2, 2019 7 p.m. March 2, 2019 4.43 p.m. March 1, 2019 5.09 p.m. March 1, 2019 4.42 p.m. March 1, 2019 4.32 p.m.